Coronation Street viewers were less than impressed as Roy Cropper was taken in for questioning by D.S. Swain. On Friday night's installment of Coronation Street, ITV fans saw Roy Cropper arrested for the murder of Lauren Bolton. Although nobody has been found, D.S. Swain told the Weatherfield resident there was sufficient evidence to suggest that the teen had been harmed. However, as the officer grilled Roy at the station, viewers were left reeling over the scenes as many rushed to defend the beloved character. Kassam said, This is excruciating. Poor Roy. He always tells the truth. Evelyn has to tell them he cleaned the flat because of her moaning. As Bobby Crawford saw Roy cleaning Lauren's flat, the police wasted no time in asking why he was doing so, implying he was getting rid of the evidence. While they were speaking it transpired the police had found blood and traces of human tissue, most likely from a blunt head trauma. During the questioning, Roy explained he'd thrown out a broken chair while cleaning up the flat along with other belongings. Realizing they were suggesting he had something to do with the suspected attack, Roy told them, I wouldn't attack Lauren, I wouldn't attack anyone. I'm not a violent person. However, it was clear D.S. Swain wasn't believing Roy as she probed him about the extra cash he left her when dropping off her wages before she vanished. He explained that he'd given her extra as he felt sorry for the teen, although when he was asked if he knew about her Ovid's account, he didn't. Trying to be as honest as he could, Roy said, although it doesn't entirely surprise me. She did offer herself to me on one occasion. Probing further, D.S. Swain found it hard to believe an attractive 18-year-old would try to seduce an older gentleman. Agreeing, Roy replied, the idea of her offering sex, it's obscene. In the end, he was released on bail and was given a strict curfew to abide by. When he returned home, he told Carla Connor he believed this whole situation would pass, although Dee Dee Bailey told her she's seen people go to prison for a lot less. Will Roy find himself behind bars for a crime he didn't commit?